After a wild week of JUCO basketball that much resembled March Madness, the Gulf Coast women's run comes to a heartbreaking end as the Chipola Indians took down the Panhandle Conference foe, Commodores, for the state championship. In the second quarter, the Commodores down by one. When a deflected pass goes to Sarah Matthews, she finishes with contact to give her team the lead. The Indians take control, however, as Jordan McLaughlin finds the backdoor cutter. Shimmy Muhammad gets the bucket and Chipola goes into the half with an 11-point lead. Fast forward to just under three minutes remaining. The Doors giving it all they've got to try and pull off another upset. Cabrilla Lewis drains the three, making it a six-point game. That shot, however, would be the last basket for Gulf Coast as the Chipola defense holds strong in the final minutes, winning the state championship 55 to 45. With the victory, the Indians get an automatic bid to the national tournament. And in the second match of the doubleheader at Northwest Florida, the Chipola, Chipola men following the women's lead and making it a clean sweep for the state of Florida. The Indians dominate Indian River State College for the state championship. They win 77 to 61. Chipola put on a show holding a double-digit lead for the majority of the contest. An exciting evening for Mariana as their local college is sending two teams to the NJCAA National Tournament. 